What up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Office Hours. I've been watching a lot of media lately, and I'm and I'm noticing just an obsession with like stats and success and charts, especially like in the music industry. And I don't know, man. I guess I just felt like, man, let me tell you my perspective on a lot of it. I've won Grammys. I have had a number one album on Billboard 200. I have had plenty of number one albums. I have had radio singles that were top five radio singles. I don't know, man, the list goes on and on. But anyway, my point is this, is it worth it, right? Like, is it worth it? What's it like winning a Grammy? What's it like meeting Kanye? Is it another planet? Is it otherworldly? Do you, do you like the air change? What is it like? And it's really not anything special. I'm not saying that those are not awesome people who've done awesome things, and it's not like an honor to meet people who've done incredible things, but they're just people. And uh, they're people like you, they're people like me. When you win the awards, it's a cool moment to be celebrated for using the gift that God gave you. Hallelujah. But then you take it home and sits on the shelf and collects dust. I just remember being, you know, in my early 20s and uh, just running so hard and pushing so hard. And if I'm honest, my real goal during that time period, what I felt was my goal was to change the world. Internally though, there was some desire to win. There was some desire to reach the top. And the closer you get to whatever the perceived top is, the more you start wanting it. And you get consumed with the idea. And so I remember being consumed with the idea of going number one or winning a Grammy when it became a reality. But then you get it and it's like, oh, that's it, huh? And there's nothing else to do but get it again. So I think people spend a lot of time trying to climb the mountain, right? You're just climbing and pushing and trying to get to the top. You're fighting so hard to get up there. And then when you get up there, you realize like, I thought my life was gonna be just so much different. And whether that's making millions of dollars or winning tons of awards, at the end of the day, you're just now a person who is still gonna have death in your family, still gonna have insecurities, still gonna have struggles, still gonna be tired, still gonna be hungry with money and awards. All I'm trying to say is this, people. Work hard and do it out of love. Success is really not what you do compared to other people. Success is what you do compared to what you were created to do. I was created to make art. I was created to influence, to challenge the status quo. I was created to inspire. And if I'm doing that, I'm successful. If I beat somebody on the charts, doesn't make my impact any less or more. Yeah, I just, I guess I would say, man, if you're fighting to win, 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 nothing wrong with winning, but if it defines you, you'll be sorely disappointed. And then you're gonna have to come to the reality that you can't win forever. What? So win at being you, win at being who you were created to be, and uh, the rest is history. Hey yo, thanks for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Also, check me out on Instagram at L-E-C-R-A-E. Look right. Blessings.